Hello everybody, my name is Chris Laffey. I'm Senior Product Line Manager in the HVU here at Lenovo. And I'm here to talk to you about something that we're extremely excited about. It's the launch of our new SE100 server. So the SE100 server is the first lightweight hybrid processor server to bring to market. As you can see here, the form factor of the server is very, very small. But with the hybrid processor in here, we have GPU and NPU directly on chip providing up to 95 AI tops directly within the base system. It's also very lightweight, about six pounds, can be mounted anywhere, and we can mount up to three of these in a single 1U rack mountable chassis. That means that we can deliver the power of software-defined infrastructure, hyper-converged infrastructure, and the power that our customers are looking for in a very small form factor at a very small budget envelope. A couple of different innovations with this product. The first thing is, it is a server. It has out-of-band management that is built in. It has a BMC chip directly on the motherboard, soldered to the motherboard. This allows us to provide things like orchestration, automation, lifecycle management, and near zero touch deployment to our customers with the single box. We've also changed the way it's cool. You'll see that we have fans on top of the system instead of in the system. That's what these cool fins are for. To make sure if something is placed on top, we're able to maintain airflow even with an obstruction at the top of it. What this also does is this allows us to provide a broader fan size. If you whistle, you know, the smaller the aperture, the more noise it makes. So by replacing the micro fans with these broader fans, we're able to keep the ambient noise down to about 35 dBA, which is about the sound of your living room when it's very quiet. However, when we think about the use cases for this device, whether it's healthcare, retail, industrial, or oil and gas, we need to provide this with a different personality. This system here is also an SE100, but you'll see that it has an additional sidecar. In this case, it has a GPU, either an RTX 1000 or an RTX 2000E. That increases the tops up to about 160 tops so you can aggregate more cameras and do more inferencing, more AI goodness at the edge. However, we can also personality the device. We can also make this a networking card for network expansions for things like security devices, firewalls, and gateways. Another thing that we can do is we can provide an industrial IO card on the side of this. This allows it to be SCADA, CAN bus, Modbus, all of the industrial protocols that we don't traditionally see in IT. This is all powered by the brand new Intel Core Ultra 7 or Core Ultra 5 processor. These hybrid processors are going to bring AI everywhere and allow us to democratize AI and make AI affordable across the IT landscape. We're really excited when we think about the use cases for this, whether it's loss prevention or football, traffic counting, associate management in retail, or it's quality assurance, predictive maintenance, digital twin. We're very excited to bring this innovation to you, and we're really looking forward to interacting with you and teaching you about the utilization of this device. Thank you very much for taking the time to listen to me today as we announce our low power, cost-effective AI device into the marketplace. Lenovo, Lenovo. Thank you.